Hey y'all, it is Dave with Master German Odor Removal. I am coming to you live from the west side of Phoenix, Arizona. I am in the garage of a beautiful corporate rental. Now, it just looks like a garage, right? Um, and in this, in this area, there's a definite urine smells. I'm here to treat, uh, I'm here to treat smoke odors, not urine, uh, but we will do the very best we can to find it. I don't see any obvious evidence of urine you know it's it's black but that's an oil stain that's right where a car goes right you can even see the board to tell you where your front tire stops um so i don't see any just immediate obvious um things one thing that you check when you're looking for a situation like this stick your nose so that was an old uh window mount ac unit we'll tape that up and then down here it's not extra hard there, um, but you know, car, a cat could be marking outside. And here's why you'd wonder if it's a cat marking outside. It is right by the trash bin. And so a cat might say, you know, that's mine. <laughs> so let's see if we can smell anything down here. No, we don't. So locating the source of the odor is really important. And treating it at night, of course, we do. You can see that we've got a couple, one, two, and then down low, we've got to get those um, sealed off so we can fill this space with the gas vapor. Um, and then let's see what else we have. And we know the garages aren't sealing completely because of the water intrusion under the windows, but I don't think that'll matter for us with our gas vapor tonight. Um, yeah, so I don't see any other issues in here that are big, just those three uh, penetrations that will seal up. And then here we are in the house, and it is just adorable. It's a great place, really big. Um, and I don't have, there's not one hot spot that really stands out with a cigarette odor. It was treated with ozone prior to me. I'm checking to see, did those filters come out? And they did. So perfect. Um, I asked them to have the filters out so that we don't perpetuate those odors. And so it's just this big, gorgeous, you know, house. The backyard looks like a resort. The backyard's pretty incredible. Um, so what we want to do is come through. Ozone just doesn't work for smoke odors, everybody. It might work for some uh, odors, but smoke is not one of those. Um, anything at yeah, Curry, it doesn't work for that. Anyways, um, what we're going to do is we're going to set this house up we're gonna over treat it. So, um, and remember when we treat a home, you're looking for surface area, surface area. And so this has more than double the surface area because it's open porous wooden blinds. And so we'll get all these set like this so that the gas, hard to do it backwards here, there we go. So the gas vapor will come up and fill that cavity. And so this is how we prep a house. A lot of people, you know, wonder how do you do what you do? Well, this is it. We go through, we find if we can find the source. In this house, we can't, but we do know that we have two very different odors going on. One in the garage, and it's bad. And then one in the house. So uh, we did a walk around. Everything looks great. There's no obvious odor source. They had ozone treatment done in the house um, a year ago and then remodeled it. They repainted the ceilings, the walls, they primed and painted, put new flooring in some of the areas. Um, I'm trying to find the thermostat, here we go. And so um, the bummer is the guarantee was a three month guarantee. We're gonna crank this down. Uh, okay, we're gonna get it going cold. So right now it's 86 in here. I turn it down to 75. So we're gonna turn it down to 75, and then um, when we leave, um, we will turn it back up to probably 78 or nine or 80. And the reason we're doing that is um, we're gonna cool it down so that you know the temperature goes down, 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 and then when we start our gas vapor, we want the air conditioning off. And it'll fill the house with the gas vapor, it'll fill um, all the, you know, the, up to the ceiling, and it's high ceiling, so we're gonna do extra. Um, we'll fill it with a gas vapor. And then when the temperature gets above that threshold, it'll kick back on. And what that does is it sucks all the gas vapor up into here. And then we're treating the whole entire 
HVA system, the ductwork, you can't even get into this stuff usually, right? And so we fill it with a gas vapor down to 124 picometers, tiny, tiny, tiny. So that is what our game plan will be. I'll come back, I'll make another quick video about how we set this house up. But remember, we over treat all the time because I don't ever want to make good on my warranty. You know, I mean, I always want to make, you know, I want to do, I want to give, I always want to give a quality product. And of course, I'm going to warranty anything that, that, you know, because we offer a guarantee, right? But the reason we offer a really steadfast guarantee is that I very rarely, very rarely um, have to retreat anything. Uh, I did one retreat, I don't know, a couple years ago. Um, our, our, uh, one of our locations did a retreat this year, actually. Uh, but they, they just didn't, they, they saved a little bit of chemical. And, um, and so I'll check out the next video on this. You can look for, um, I'll probably tie out like corporate rental, Airbnb, short-term rental, SCR, I don't know, whatever. But uh, look for the next video in this series and we'll show you what buckets we put where and why we use buckets and not fancy machines. There's a very, very good reason uh, well, there's about eight good reasons, but um, why we keep this business low tech in our application methods, high tech in the chemistry. So it's high tech where it matters, low tech where it doesn't matter. And both of those things are important that they work hand in hand that way. So let me get this last set of blinds and I'm gonna start bringing equipment in. We've got a lot to do tonight. And so sit tight, check out the next video. I'll come back and show you how we set up this gorgeous house. Oh, by the way, if, if you're check in here, right? You wanna, wanna make sure that there's not like anything in there and you wanna make sure your windows are closed. These windows are closed and locked as they should be. So but remember a vented window hurts you because we're filling with the gas paper. Okay, I'm totally off. I need to get to work. I can't hold this camera and think at the same time, really. It's sad. Bye. Oh, if you have any questions, uh, go ahead and hit me up at Dave at mastergerm.com or mastergerminodorremoval.com. Um, or better yet, if you do YouTube, I'll know it came from YouTube. It gives me a little, it helps me to know where, you know, what, what I'll be talking to somebody about. Um, or give us a call. We have an 800 number on the website. Um, the North Carolina number rings right to my cell phone. So um, either one of those is fine. Uh, I'll talk to you soon.